Hey yo, what's up guys? It's your boy Ten Yasin One. <laughs> I'm sorry, <laughs> just really wanted to do that. And anyways, hey there guys. And today I, I've, I've like come up with something. Just wanted to show you guys something I have been working on recently. And I think it's actually really good, really fun. And it's just basically uh, some of the melee combat mechanics I've been working on using melee weapons such as swords and stuff. So basically just made a basic pairing dodging system which also which relies quite a lot on animations themselves as well and it's pretty simple pretty easy to use pretty easy to and pretty fun to play with so uh, here's an example of how the actual uh, player works around also here we have our character I'm using a dual shock 4 to pretty much control it and you can take out the sword. I'm sorry for the sword being, um, you know, drawing a, a, a bit late and stuff. You can move around. You can run around. And as you can see, it's pretty good. Pretty simple. And then you can pretty much, you know, hit. So unlike, you know, heavy light attacks, this is basically, you know, square for left slash, circle for right slash, X for... Uh, I don't know, bottom slash <laughs> or something. And triangle for basically dodging. If I want to dodge, I could just press triangle. And as you can see, just dodges. And I can pretty much dodge like uh, like backwards based on where I'm moving. And right. And I can charge forward, dash forward like this. I can even combine attacks by dashing forward. So I can combine that like that. That's pretty that. That's that's pretty much that. So the parry uh, pairing works pretty quite similarly to how the actual fighting mechanics works. Basically, based on the enemy's actual moves. So if he's swinging from the right side, you have to press the square button. Basically, left key or left button. All right. While 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 holding the L2 trigger, which uh, means that you're inside the pairing mod. In that mod, you can't swing your sword. Okay, that's that. Let's try it out with uh, basic enemy and stuff. So here we are, and there's uh, there's the enemy. As you can see, he hits you, and yeah, there you go. So based on the angles. Now I'm holding the key, I can't attack him, and he was almost there to just get me and all. Alright, alright, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, he's a bit too fast, but um, we'll get there. There we go, I, I, I got him one, one time. So as you can see, we're not targeting him and he's facing the enemy all in self. And I'm sorry, the AI is not really intelligent. So, there we go, just kill them, that's that. Pretty simple, sorry if the area is not very well lit, but yeah, that's that. Then, further moving on, uh, we have this guy, so basically the two enemies all together, and I can either, ouch, alright, let me, let me move to the side. Now, also the enemies have their own patterns, they have... Uh, three attacks they can hit us with and they have conditions so they randomly choose whether to hit us with one attack two or three all together and once they're they're done doing so they back they retreat as you can see they kind of back off I am sorry I'm, I'm quite horrible in my own game there we go oh you notice this attack so you gotta pretty much observe from which angle he's hitting you and based on that you can Ouch. And I'm sorry, I'm, <laughs> I'm using a cheat so I can't really die. <laughs> Ouch. I got one of them. Oh, shit. That, that was a bit too fast for me. I'm still working on the mechanics so that, you know, two enemies won't attack you simultaneously because it's practically impossible to dodge them. As you, as you can see, I just jumped over while attacking. So that's one of the glitches which I've been looking to kill. 
And I've, I've been a bit too lazy to pretty much kill those glitches and epic fight starts now. Alright. I think I dodged that one. There we go. Oh, okay. I was gonna be really epic if I dodged all those attacks all in a row, but I pretty much failed to. Ah! Okay, I'm sorry. <laughs> too many attacks. The combo is real. Alright, uh, I would have been dead long ago if it weren't for the cheats. And yeah, as you can see, it's pretty glitchy. So I, uh, you saw how the dodging doesn't quite fits with the, the attacking. So when I dodge, so I, uh, I dodge like this, and I try to attack, then uh, there, there are some certain glitches when we attack the enemy. So yeah, let's end this there. Enough playing around, mate. Okay, what? No, 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 no! You can't do this to me, man. There we go. Those were pretty, uh, quite some fun attacks. Now, there, there, there are basic combos you can just combine the swings, and those will be your combos. So basically, left swing, right swing, and downwards. Then, right swing, left swing, and downwards. Those are just the three combos I have. There, are, what two combos? I'm sorry. And you could you could do this as well. Maybe start with the down swing and this. You can call that a combo. And yeah, that's that. So, it's pretty much it. Uh, I know the, the the taking sword out and the take putting sword back in is not very convincing. But yeah. And uh, that's pretty much it. Hopefully you guys like this. It's uh, actually quite fun playing it, trying it out, and I might as well release a short uh, gameplay demo. Well, not gameplay demo, but like maybe a demo you can try out. But uh, I still have to work on more of the enemy's behavior, so basically they would have certain behaviors like patrolling in an area and they have uh, they, they still don't have any sight or vision and I'm planning on adding that as well so they, they can notice you they can hear you so sort of a bit more like stealth as well and you know certain AI behaviors and more combos dodging more enemy patterns attack patterns and stuff and maybe making them more intelligent. And also, I'm, I'm, I'm thinking of all adding some supernatural elements to the game itself. So, uh, lots ahead, lots of planning there, but I hope that it actually ends up as I want it to end up, pretty much. Yeah, anyways, I hope you guys um, uh, liked where this is going. I mean, I don't know, that's what you can call this. And yeah, hopefully it was fun. Um, while we're working on this, I've been working on a horror game as well, but I just I'm kind of out of the ideas. So yeah, it's pretty much uh, on hold and stuff. And plus, there's a lot of going on these days, so I've been making much of uh, tutorials or anything like that. I'm sorry for that, but hopefully soon I'll be working on some stuff. Let me know any suggestions, any thoughts. Any ideas for future tutorials? Uh, anything which I may or may not, <laughs> or which I should be doing, maybe gameplay videos even, but yeah. And I've been drawing some stuff as well, so if you want, want to see something, request it. I'm not, I'm not really an amazing artist, or even a good one right now, I believe, but still, I hope it ends up, works good. Anyways, that's that, guys. I'm sorry for punching into the mic. <laughs> But uh, hopefully, I'll see you guys soon. And that's that. Peace out.